here we are. Here we are in New York City, waiting on Scruff Daddy Dog. Welcome, Theodore, 7.36 p.m. As soon as Scruff gets here, it's ramen and gyoza. No, it's not. It's fucking edit and work on the lookbook. And then ramen and gyoza. We honestly see if we need a reservation to use fucking New York City. We also need to figure out a rental car. That's what I'm doing right now. That's why I'm opening my computer. <laughs> but I'm actually, the last three days. I'm actually doing it. These robes, though, these robes are made for thin people. It's pretty obvious. They really don't fit if you have any sort of thickness to you whatsoever. Hey. Hello. How are you? Good. Are you going yeah, to the yeah. spa? Oh, no. Oh, I'm just, sorry. I'm actually, it looks like I'm going to oh. the spa. I'm just going to meet my friend in the lobby. Oh, okay. And I found this robe in the closet, but I think they're made for really thin guys because yeah. kind of weird. You have to tie it a little higher. Yeah, like, more around your waist, yeah. not your belly. Yeah, like there. Can you hold this? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> There you go. That's a bit better. It's a little better. Yeah. Thank you. Press three because that's no. I understand. I, yeah. I just assumed. I would think the same thing. I love Vancouver. Right. You can smoke weed right in the streets. Yeah. It's unbelievable. It's completely legal. I love it. Yeah. It's yeah. Vancouver. Easy. Come on in. I'm just waiting for my friend behind you. <laughs> Scruff, what up? Chilling, man. You get these robes in the room. It's really. Oh, this is a packed. Oh, wait. This is gonna be a fun weekend. Yeah. A lot of work, but a lot of fun. This ain't, this ain't nothing like Japan. Three times as tight in an elevator. This is like huge. That was fun. What? But here's another nothing that you made into something. Can't we just? Can't just. Did not invite me to your wedding. <laughs> so now, now it's fucking personal. Now there's blood on the line. Next, give me the next line. Can't just leave it off that way. <laughs> These lines don't even make sense. All right, wait, I'm going to go to a different song. Fake Love, that'll yeah, be... We're discussing the fact that if Drake... If Drake was in the It's so car dark, with you, these angles. If Drake was in the car with you and was talking about the things that he talks about in his songs, you would kick him out of the car. So far, our first song proves that to be true. I've been down so long, it looked... Like up to me. They look up to me. I got fake people showing fake love to me. <laughs> fake people showing fake love to me. You kick him out right there. He's like, Drake, dog. Passion Fruit. No. Essential album. Let's go through his essentials. He has an essential album. I think everybody does. Yeah, like they make a playlist, they call it. Hello? Yeah, I just walked in. Yeah, I'm good. You still working tonight? Right now? Did I go out? Yeah, I went out. I went. Oh, this is him on the phone in the driver's seat. Yeah. Oh, okay. Cups of rose, bitches in my old phone. I should call one and go home. I've been in this club way too long. The woman that I would try is Imagine happy with a good guy. You're, you're with him at the club. He walks up. I don't even remember the stupid ass line. Are you drunk right now? I'm just saying you could do better. Tell me, have you heard that lately? I'll start hating only if you make me. Ugh, cups of the XL. We should recreate this cover. We could do it in this room. The cover right yeah. We should put out a shirt that just says Teddy and the take care font. Go see JC and go get dinner. Yeah, let's do it. Do you want to bring this? Giraffe. Yeah. Photo op. Oh shit. Open bar. Go. Open bar. Go. Photo op. Hey, Soho. Oh shit. <laughs> shit is real. This is the store's name? Yeah. Jody's working here. Is this where he's with Champion now? I'll cop this whole fit, dog. <laughs> Wear that shit tomorrow. It's cool that they have the big C's. What up? Yeah. 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 I know this guy face for sure. Oh, doing? nice. Teddy, right? Yeah, yeah. What's going on, yeah. bro? How you doing? Ernie, nice to meet you. Got here for Urban Assassin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's too, bro. Nice. nice. Nobody can walk up there now? Crazy in there, bro. Already? No, like, ain't really nobody in there, but the heat in there. All right, we'll see you tomorrow. There you go. I got a lot of size 13 J's for you, bro. People were dumping them last year. <laughs> Basically, the thing that I told American Eagle, they were like, all right, so how do we go about inventory? And I'm like, well, basically, I just got to go around the world buying shoes, right? They were like, all right, well, how much do you need? And so I think I need at least a million. Yeah. And I, and I, I spent a million dollars on sneakers in, in three days. What SB is that? Uh, uh, Michael Lau. Michael Lau. That's like five thousand dollars. These are like twenty thousand dollars. These are like six thousand. Oh, dude. These are all like ten thousand. Put that jeans on. DJ Khaled. So Flight Club has one for forty, but your boy's always about throwing a bone. So that one's only fifteen thousand. Thirteen? It's your size. Huh? I'll wear it out. I got your favorite rappers, Jordan Elevens. Drake. Oh, we were just reciting Drake lyrics in the hotel room. I like the pink one. Where is it? 
It's inside the suit. Here, so let me open this. Here, here's your thumbnail. Crap. Your thumbnail. Hey. Wait, let me get. I have to be crying. It's funny because I have <laughs> to be crying. Wait, Justin. This is Kylie Jenner's pair. Oh, it's the only grade school ever made. Wow. Wow. That's 20 grand. I didn't go too hard on Yeezys. I didn't go too hard on Yeezys because I felt like those were going to be the first things that consignors were going to bring a lot of. So I tried to grab representation of what I could. I grabbed a little bit of Adidas, right? Because since the last time I seen you on the resale side, Adidas has changed a little bit. Yeah, I'd say so. Because <laughs> two is always better than one. Uh, my size. Can I get your opinion on that the Airbnb is just 30 bucks home? Yeah. Nah. It's the Reebok Yeah. It's the Reebok That's big. It's not me. It's big pun. But we're about the same weight nowadays. And then it says two J's on it. Nice. Oh wait. Well, these are these are custom. Custom job. Yeah. It has the date that I started the brand. Oh crazy. When did you get these? Uh, when I went to Australia, I, I did a custom bespoke guy. That's ID. sick. Oh, that's right. I remember you. We texted about it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not. Well, I mean, when I started my YouTube channel. That's, oh yeah, I got it on the model over there. Uh, shoe boxes. Oh, nice. This is the only time I'm ever gonna print them, and if you look, the, the tags are Metro parts. Nice. Oh, that's dope. This is what a million dollars worth of shoes looks like. These fancy little logos. That's cool, this little inventory, yeah, that's yeah. cool. This is your favorite section, the Jordan 1 section right yeah. here, bro. <laughs> hey, what a photo op, hey. <laughs> We're doing drop top photo ops. All yeah. Time. I need like one yeah. of those like real serious, like pushing them all aside, you know? Like, wait, wait, there it is. Yeah. We're gonna have so many photos of here. I can already see JC like staring at his phone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is fucking full yeah. talk city yeah, right here, city. bro. You should just charge $5. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, if, yeah. if I was able to charge for the pictures at this point, I, I think I could leave YouTube alone. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we're gonna be giving away a pair of Travis Scott's tomorrow. Nice. It's like a $2,000 shoe right now. We're giving that away. A custom jackets from Exclusive Game, yeah, where he takes like the scarves. Made, yeah. yeah, so we're gonna announced that we're gonna give away two cars worth up to 50 grand. We're gonna pay for the registration and the fucking insurance. Damn. The catch, I'm trying to win that. The catch <laughs> is you have to do probably like six figures in consignment sales to qualify, and it's to kind of incentivize the community to, you know, sell their shit the yeah, way you want, cool. right? No, that's cool. You know, a lot of our, our neighbors are at 20%. It, I, they, they've got great relationships and they're just used to what they're doing, but I'd like them to give us a try and this, I think, motivates them to kind of thing. Yeah. And then also kicks back to one of my first videos ever on social media. I said I want to give away a car in a house. Yeah. I got to figure out how I give the house away, but um, yeah, right now we're giving away two cars, one in New York, one in Vegas. I tell you how to give the house away. Yeah. Right. <laughs> just throw the keys. Right, just good. throw the keys out of me. Yeah, I moved to Vegas. It'll be lit. Cost of living's reasonable. I know, that's what I was telling someone the other day. So how much are you going to be out here now? Probably the first three, four months, I'm going to be out here a lot. Yeah. Like half my time will be out here. But uh, realistically, I, I'd like to come out here maybe three to four days a month. You know, the cool thing about uh, Lincoln with American Eagle is that they recognize that I'm wearing all these hats, right? Like I'm the guy that runs social media. I'm the guy that's making the executive decisions with finance. The hiring manager, I'm the sales floor manager, I'm everything. So they're helping me take all these hats off and allowing me more to be the guy that the face right I told them that I needed help with retail I wanted to fix retail real quick so I could then take my time and focus my energy on uh, inspiring and motivating going out here telling the story and trying to help these kids I really want to try to make a push to open up a nonprofit this year there's no like set intention as to what we're gonna help it's more about helping whoever needs help regardless of what that help is whether it's you need somewhere to fucking live or it's you want to design a call you want to start a clothing brand we're gonna figure out a way to get all that help to happen from facilitator yeah yeah dream so, facilitator yeah That's pretty your new, much your new your new yeah, uh, dream, bio. dream creator jc jc yeah. no uh, we gotta be careful with dream creator. yeah you dream creator with a cube yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, have, I have my third meeting with some folks from toronto um we're, we're talking about opening a, a, a toronto oh, store okay. next oh, cool. so Damn, uh, the game plan is to knock, knock out all the details within the next three months and to possibly open it on my birthday, which is October 6th. And the plan is to be in on Toronto. the 6th. In the 6th. In the 6th. Six, six, on the 6th. Six, right? Yeah. So, so Toronto's, Toronto's the next one. You know, when I signed the deal at Fashion Show Mall, I signed a one year with a one year option. You know, May 25th is one year. 
nothing's wrong with the fashion show, but we definitely want to make it better. So we're going to explore either making it better and bigger there, or we're going to move again and make it even bigger. I, I want to turn it into like Disneyland. I've always said I wanted to turn it into Disneyland. And we're talking about bringing in slot machines, like delis, bars, oh, turning shit. into 24 hours in Vegas, like straight 24 hour That's fucking awesome. shit. Oh, so, shit. Like sneaker shaped pizza. Yeah, that, that would be different. That definitely would be different. <laughs> I mean, you know, I, could I, I, I was thinking more like Delhi and then being like fucking a uh, Wu Bagel and like the bagel shape, like a Wu Tang logo. Like, but that's not different. Yeah, uh, my sneaker shaped uh, pizza uh, is so far out there. Yeah. We got Wu Bagels coming yeah. up. Sneaker shaped yeah. pizza, like, I would feel like I got cheated out of pizza. If you, yeah. If you gave me like, yeah. A, like, if you gave me an Ultra Boost sli pepperoni, you know, pizza. But if I give you a Jordan 11, I mean, it's so then, then you got a lot more pizza because the shoe's taller. <laughs> well, you get to choose Slice. Yeah, uh, choose your slice. Cream cheese rules everything around me. Doesn't have Fox, a fucking cream cheese rules <laughs> everything around. Me. This guy is like, he is. <laughs> doesn't miss a beat. Uh, but yeah, man, this is you and bro. That's great, dude. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, man. Congratulations, JC. Yeah, it's great. They're gonna put billboards all over the city, man. Your yeah. face gonna be on? Uh, I maybe. That would be. It should be. Throwing out all our social media shit on it. You so. and Danielle and Rivoli will have billboards. Did you see my episode on Full Size Run yet? No, is it, it's out. It went today. No, Yo, they, so the one part uh, that I really didn't think that they were going to throw on there and they threw it on there was when they were like, Yo, so we got, Welty's like, I got an issue with you. I got beef with you. And I'm like, all right, what is it? You're biting sneaker shopping. Like, Yo, so I'm just curious. Did you guys trademark picking up a camera and following somebody shopping? Like you guys invented that? So I'm like, yeah, so you guys invented sneaker shopping? Yeah. Yeah, and you own the store. I was like, yo, if you want, I could take the G off of it to make it sneaker shopping. And I'll add a parenthesis after like an apostrophe at the end of it, so it's different. And then he's still like going on, like really upset about it. And look, I get it. In that setting, his role is purposely to be a dick. But the dude's not, he's really not a dick, dog. It's just, yeah. it's for the camera. So I was like, yo, you know what the biggest difference is between Don't your sneaker take. shopping and my sneaker shopping? And he was like, what? I was like, your shit's fake. Yeah. Your buys are fucking fake. Mine aren't. Like, no, they're not. I was like, yes, they are. No, they're not. Yes, they are. And we went back seven or eight times, but that got chopped. And then I had an um, email. Because they, because they tried to get Tiesto on my fucking show, and on the show they wanted to give him five thousand dollars store credit, and, and he may or may not buy stuff. <laughs> I asked. I know. I just noticed. Get her out of here. Get her out of here. I literally asked Teddy if she'd make it. <laughs> How is she on the plane? Her she slept the whole way through. Nice. Nice to see you. Hey, congrats. This is so exciting. Thank you. Billy, Billy. Billy. I would say probably about an hour or two jobs. I'll just get up with you tomorrow morning. Then. Uh, yeah, I'll be in change retail. Yeah. Like, bro, it's in an American Eagle. It's in an American yeah. Eagle. Yeah. Retail's changed. Yeah. American Eagle. Yeah. That's a new, that's a, they're calling it American Eagle. Yep. It's Jay's American Eagle. American Eagle. <laughs> and Joni, you can be you. Yep. Yeah. It's American Jeagle. Yeah. American Eagle. All right, and like that, we're out of here. Into the cold streets in New York. Let's look up the address before we go outside. This is it. Go, go, go ahead. You guys go. You could be part of the B-roll. Step right up. They got sushi. Do they? Oh, it's on, dude. It's gonna be like we're back in Japan again. All right. It's definitely a different menu in Japan. Well, maybe because they give you the American menu right here in Japan. So I got like four. Wait, I didn't go to this place in Japan. You were long gone. Okay. Idaho. Yeah. Doing some fucking Idaho shit. Me and me and my friend Elbow. Maybe you've heard of them. We were dining, talking about the arts and the culture of the world. And I was experiencing culture in Idaho. Laying in a bunk like this, feeling the sway of a, a, a tour bus that you didn't wake up dead. Do you know I think that sometimes in bed? I don't even know how to use chopsticks. Really? Oh, dog. We'll show you. Yeah, it's easy. This is great news. the best air
airplane cheeseburger I ever had. That's also the only airplane cheeseburger you've ever had. Photo op. Nice. I'll get Brandy's name on me right now. <laughs> no, you will not. Yes, I will. Take the camera and we'll go in there. Are you ready for this? Because I, I am. I think you're trying to call my bluff. Go find out how much it costs. You won't do it. <laughs> I'll get, where would I get it? I gotta really think You about realize it. that these people are really bad tattooers, right? That's the best part. <laughs> I don't know. Now you're freaking me out, dude. Let's get dessert. They're gonna be open. Oh, sorry. The Domino's guy. We almost got it. <laughs> yeah, they're not supposed to be on the sidewalk. The fuck are you apologizing to him for? Oh, sorry, sorry. Sorry you were out on the fucking sidewalk. That's where the bulb of tea was, and I'm looking at the side. It's the 19th photo op. No. What you gotta say? The whole hotel smells like weed. Yeah, we left a bag open. <laughs> the whole place smells. I'm gonna hide it in the drawer. Shit. What? Snack pack. Oh, the hidden snack pack. Activated walnuts. Activated. <laughs> Hippie shit. Out of here. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Yo, 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 it's me. It's me. Dirty E on the ones and threes. I'm here. On the ones and threes. Wait. Yeah, he Live. He we up in the building. I don't even know what time 10, it is. 1024 10, AM. Battery's dying. Ooh. Little crackhead jarble. <laughs> We're going to Chinatown. Ring, bing. No, see, now that sounds fucking racist because you I was already singing ring, ring ding, ding dong before you turned the camera on. <laughs> it had nothing to do with that. I'm just thinking about food. I'm getting so hungry. I'm half listening to what you're saying and I'm half just like, we're going to Chinatown. We're close to it. We could eat yakitori. No? Daddy don't like that idea. Yakitori is just meat skewers and shit on a grill. Technically, it's chicken. Only chicken skewers. Real, the word yakitori, yeah. we learned that. We just had it the other day. I wonder if there's a here. Maybe. I feel like we could get more authentic. I want to feel like I'm in Japan. I don't want to feel like I'm in Japan. He just came back. I want to feel like I'm in America. Last night wasn't authentic either. No, Last it wasn't. Last night was definitely a little American. Night. Yeah, no, and definitely it was. Good. It was. It's fuck. I mean, I'm not saying that in a bad way. What's it? Dim? It was nice. We, I don't know. Dim Thai, they don't have it. <laughs> What if I just tackled you? <laughs> he just didn't stop. What would you have done? I don't know. Never been to Chinatown? Here we are. Looking for menus we can't read. No, shoot, that's what you want. Oh my god, this is so cool. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, I feel you, I feel you. I smell that shit getting you naked. <laughs> you can take that with you. Just take it for the road. We gotta keep it moving, but... Thank you. Gentlemen, God bless you, my brother. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. appreciate it. For Welcome sure. to New York. Yeah. Angel. Angel. Take it Enjoy. easy. Petty. Eddie. Eddie. Ernie. Er scruff. Eddie, Teddy, and Scruff. Yup, Eddie, Teddy, and Scruff. All right, homie. Take it easy. Peace. Is that the joint you said that you brought? It's not the joint ooh, I was talking ooh, about. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Like, Dave, you had Yo, that that's thing on, my half you joint. You had that thing on you the whole time, and you made us stand there for fucking like 10 minutes. I didn't even know what the combo was about. I like, I'm, I'm filming the sign, and then I turn around, and you guys are. Like, hey. What do you want to eat? We got him live. Turn the fucking camera off. I don't know. What do you want to eat? Gato. <laughs> Arigato. Arigato gozaimasu. Sacrificing it to the city. Someone's gonna come and be very happy. Yeah, so not knowing what you want to eat is the hard part. Gotcha. You just keep saying Japanese because you, for some reason, think we're in Japan. Like he had ramen last night, and now he's like, oh, I'm back. I'm back. Angel's back. How long is the town for? Two days. Yeah. What, what nice places you see in, in New York? That's what we're looking for. Stand, uh, you, can, you can take the stand on the ferry? Right Not the yet. Ferry. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. it enjoy. All right, man. Come back in the summer when you see the, the top of the Oh, yeah. shit! Let's try this Chinese place, Chow House. Angel's Wild. Angel's Wild. I like them, though. Let's take them to lunch.
hold up. We just ate so much food, but I'll do it for the vlog, you know? Oh no, hold on, I'm losing it.